Hi guys, Country Gaming back again with another, or well, not with another, back in Euro Truck Simulator 2. Uh, this is part two of our trip from Liege to uh, Inns Innsbruck. Innsbruck, however you say it. Um, we remember last time we um, pulled over at a gas station here to sleep and we haven't got all that far to go so hopefully we'll be able to finish we'll pop in our truck start the engine um, make sure our lights are operational um, make sure our um, everything is on, all our lights and stuff is on, which they are, so yeah, um, we'll have a quick look at the map to show you um, how far we've got to go, um, so yeah, okay, we are here, just outside of um, the things covering up. My little blue icon is cover was covering up the name. Okay, we're just outside of Map Manheim, Manheim in. Um, whatever part of Europe we're in and we are heading down to here to Innsbruck so we've only got that short leg to do so that shouldn't take all that long so yeah so we'll hit the road hopefully we won't hit any snags on the way we have fuel we've slept it would help if I put it in forward into drive and yeah that might be helpful if we take off the handbrake so off we go at least it's daytime yeah so part one I am um, is ready to upload I haven't uploaded it yet uh, that will be getting uploaded tonight uh, today is uh, Tuesday in Australia here and um, yeah so part one will get uploaded tonight so that will be live for you guys on Wednesday uh, sometime and this what we're doing now part two will be um, ready for you to guys to watch on Thursday um, so yeah so you'll have something to watch hope you enjoy the video hope you're enjoying the trip with me so we don't want to remember last in the last episode we um, had a few speeding fines <coughs> fingers crossed we don't get too many more of them so yeah just making sure we're not we're going in the right direction still and we don't have to turn off and miss turn offs like I tend to do because I'm too busy driving on the road watching where I'm driving and all of us and not keeping an eye on the route advisor and I suddenly go past the turn off. Traffic doesn't seem to be too bad, nice and fairly quiet, which is good the way I like it. But um, I mean I like it. I like having traffic on the road but not 
not so much that you that you get stuck behind somebody or they cause a traffic jam. Um, I've installed another mod. It's the realistic fuel price mod for Euro trucks in two, but I haven't enabled it yet because I thought I don't want to stuff up this last episode, so I thought I'll um, and now it's raining. Typical. I hate driving in the rain. these things to go not like that. Oh shit, there you go. See, I wasn't even, wasn't even looking where I'm going. Okay, I was playing with the could go faster than this. I pressed it twice. Might put a bit more lights on, have the headlights on I think. Or rather have the high beam on I should say. Don't know why we can't go that way. There is definitely a road there. Yeah, so now yeah, it's turned all horrible. Avoid that truck. down the hill and through a tunnel. May as well leave the lights on while we're at it. I mean not the lights, the couple of lights, but the wipers. when I start yapping, when I start talking. Okay, let's have a look at you. Ah, yep, the box that we're carrying is jammed right up against the rail. So it looks like we're going to have to do a, a trip to the fix-it shop. So how far do we have? 
to go and whether or not it will put us too far out of our way. Okay, then before we get transported to here, to Swingberg, Swingberg, to Strasburg, Strasburg, or Stuttgart, one or the other. Okay, seeing that we're truly stuck. So, yeah, plus when the, and our trailer is a bit damaged, and our truck, poor truck is damaged. And we're going to go to Stuttgart which is a back behind us a little way. Well, that's what happens when you don't, when you're not concentrating. Have a sip of coffee. <sighs> Sorry about this guys. Well, while we're there, we repair the truck at the same time. At least it stopped raining. So, we just repair the truck. What's it going to cost us? And there goes the stupid email, which I didn't turn off. Again, 40,000 40,959 nearly 41 grand righto at least I've got money to do it okay we don't need them I said we don't need them. We don't need the high beam. So hopefully we can get out of here. Now that we've got our truck fixed. This back to our map route route advisor. Looks like I've discovered a truck dealer. which I won't worry about right now. Yeah, I call this box that we're carrying a wide load because it's actually wider than normal. Like it's wider than the trailer. Don't hit the fence. God. Hitting everything today. Sitting railings, sitting fence. Hmm. Wonder what else I'm going to hit. Okay, get back up on this highway. Oh, 
I think I might just get in the get in the middle of the road. Seeing that the the lane because the load is so wide. If I go too if I go too close. Um, the side of the box is going to um, hit the railing so you basically can't drive where you normally would take a wide turn avoid railings Tell you what, if I hope the um, the, um, the drop off point isn't going to be too difficult. So we go down here. Keep over on the left side a little bit and stay away from. up again. So if we come across that area where we pranged the first time, I'll try and avoid it. Well, I'll It's something else. You can see I've got a wide load, but the AI is dumb, ridiculous. I know they're not real, like it's computerized, but you would think that, you know you would allow for wider loads. Oh 
have hearing aid. Now I'm self conscious. hope all this stuffing around and crashing and whatever isn't going to make me late. And we have a service station coming up. This, this past the P sign, or it's a just a sleep. This is, might just be a rest stop. But I don't think we'll be resting, even though my driver is starting to get tired again. And we've got fuel, so we'll just keep going. Bends in the road can be a bit tight. Uh, let's see. Oh, um, as I'm recording this, um, I suppose you would have noticed that uh, the um, 1.23 um, update in the beta testing is out. Um, I noticed SES software um, announced it on Steam, which I read today, this morning. Um, and that has the workshop and the, I think it's the tyres customization or the extra customization. Um, on your tyres is out. Um, I normally have, I sometimes have Euro truck in the, uh, where am I going? Straight ahead. I normally have my game on um, the update for, for the beta testing that I thought, seeing that I'm in the middle of it trip, I'll leave it. I won't update it. So I might update it after I've finished this trip. Now this is going to be fun to get around. Hopefully we don't get stuck on anything. Back of that trailer. So that'll be, I mean, I don't know, that'll be good though. I mean, 
it'll be good to have the workshop to be able to um, download mods through the workshop if you have your game through Steam like I do. Um, browse through all the mods that um, mod that modders will put in there. Which will be good. I don't know when um, the France extension DLC will be coming out though. That's another one to keep an eye out on. That'll be good to have the France extension. Um, even though we do have the, you get, do get the France extension through Pro Mods. Um, but it'll be nice to have it through SES as well. Another rest stop slash service station. And I'll keep going. Try and get us, see if I can get this um, load delivered. So I'm afraid that if I rest again, I will be very late. Because I think I saw that I've only got, I only had 10 hours to get the delivery done. Don't quote me on that until we get there. <laughs> Discovered a job market thingy. Okay. Yep, we've arrived. That's where we've got to go. This is going to be fun getting this thing around this tiny roundabout. up on the roundabout. I went too close. Go back. 
Well, at least we're off the roundabout. And I've jackknifed the thing. <sighs> and take the wide a turn as possible. And if there's any traffic behind me then tough. stuck again. Yep, I'm stuck again. goes the sign. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry guys, but <sighs> this is what happens ugh, when you load when you take wide loads. around the roundabout. waiting, I might as well have a drink of coffee. Come on, truck. Come on, move it. I think I'm stuck on something. If I can. What the frick am I stuck on this time? Okay, let's have a look. I am stuck on, yep, the railing. Now they're gonna blow their horn at me. And of course, they don't. Too bad. I'm going. we're going to get stuck here. Do 
sorry guys. Guess what? We're stuck again. I hope we can finish this job. Um. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, I'm pushing the wrong button here. Okay, we're going to have to better the fix the shop, and I think we're going to have to reroute ourselves. If we can. I don't like my chances. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so do we need to be repaired or anything while we're here? money on repair, it's not funny. Okay. Um. Sorry about the counting business. I think we might rest up here. Um, and then we'll have a look at the map and see if we can reroute ourselves. So we're going to have to go up through that narrow area because it's just going to be, we're just not going to be able to do it. So I'll just turn around. Hopefully there's no other trucks in here. If you were, if you guys were under my the same in the same circumstances that I'm in, what would you do? Would you like reroute to this what I'm going to do? Oh, good. That on. That on. Turn that off, push the enter key to sleep, then we won't have to do, I think we are definitely going to get um, too late, okay. Here. 
Okay, now we'll have a look at this map. See if we can reroute ourselves. Um, now where are we? Yeah, we've got to go here. And we're there. Okay, let's see. We've got to get out onto this highway. And we're here. And we can't... We can't go up through here to go it this way because our load is too wide. Um, let's see. Yeah, so we're going to have to... We have a cat smear again. So we're going to have to go back through this stupid roundabout. And... Go... See if we can go down here. Go down here. Down this way. Yeah, that's going to cut. Yeah, that's not going to... That's not going to cut it either. Um, okay, what else can we do? Yeah, so we need to... Unless we go back... down through here. I have no idea guys. Hang on. Oh, the cat's trying to crawl up. Go away cat. I jumped on the back of my chair. Tried sitting on my shoulder. Um. Hmm. Interesting. Um, we have to go back through this way and then go up here and then along here and then down. And then down this way to here. It's a long way around, but at least we'll get the job to where we're going to take it. I mean, that is the shortest way, but it's just the load's too wide to get the box through, to get it through that little area there. Um, yeah. Unless... We go Yeah, that's gonna be just as long if we go down this way. Down along here. Um and around. Um, 
ATS is or SES is um, gone and gone and stuff it up. Gone and like you know, so you can't reboot things just as easy. Okay, we'll try and see what happens. Truck. I don't know if I be quiet there for this for a minute. Um. Okay, yeah, we're stuck on a fence again. And we can't go backwards because of the cars. Okay, let's have a look. I'll have to get into here. Yep, smash up there.
finally got around. stuff on. Again. Yeah, so guys, if um, you were in this situation, what would you do? Would you just abandon, abandon the load and not worry about it? Or would you continue fighting with it? Leave a comment and let me know. It would be very interesting to see. I'd be very interested to see what you have to say about it. Because this is not going anywhere. Um, as you can see. We're just going to have to go back to the fix-it shop again. Um, Actually, I was watching um, a video from Squirrel, Squirrel did a while ago, um, and he basically had the same thing where he put, or he got it to the delivery point. Um, I think he was playing Euro Truck. Yeah, he was. He was playing Euro Truck, and he couldn't, and he was taking a long load and where they walk, the place where he was taking it to um, was too narrow but the gateway was too narrow for him to um, deliver to so he just he just left it there okay I'll just move this out of the out of the way. I'm just going to park this somewhere because I'm just not going to get it in. So yeah, so we'll unhook this. Uh, yeah. Um, <clears throat> yeah, sorry about that, that guys. Um, that I can't finish the load. I'm very disappointed. Um, so, yeah. So I'm just going to leave it sitting there. And the company just can just come and get it themselves. I know it's in the wrong town, but yeah. If they want it, they can come and get it. So, thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry that this episode has turned out to be such a bad ending. Um, me not being able to deliver this thing, this crate, box, whatever. Yeah, so, I'll turn this off.
Yeah, so this is Country Gaming. Um, signing off. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like and a comment below. Much appreciated. And I'll catch you next time. Catch you later, guys.